And so, so I pass that on to, to you and your listeners. Why are you crying, dude? Right? Why are we looking at the things that we can't control? And why don't we start focusing on the things that we can control? Mm-hmm. And you mentioned that, uh, you know, I've built a, a, um, a life that I've dreamt. And, and what was interesting is after I had that experience, I had a new dream. And that dream was I'm going to walk again. Not just walk again, I'm going to run again. I'm going to walk and not be weary. I'm going to run and not faint. I'm going to have a full recovery. And and again, it's been 20 plus years. I'm not running. And I'm not but walking completely. But the mountain. <laughs> but it's not the mountain, right? But I am getting there. And here's what you mentioned, that you just have to take it step by step, no matter how big a step that is. And, and, and I learned that we can focus on what we can do or we can focus on what we can't do. And so my dream was to, to walk again. I told the doctor, I'm going to walk, doc. And the doctor just laughed at me. He's like, Griff, it's impossible. You can't walk. And, and there's all the evidence stacked up against me. I had an incision from my belly button to my backbone. I, you know, they opened me up. It was an eight hour surgery. They, de- they detached my diaphragm, deflated my lung cut one of my ribs off, cleaned up the shrapnel that was inside there, put a four inch metal plate, two screws on top, two screws on the bottom. They, you know, it's reattached the diaphragm, inflated my lungs, sewed me up and stapled me shut. And so there was evidence. I couldn't even move, I couldn't even feel. And so there was evidence to stack up against me. Here's this expert over here telling me, you can't walk again, it's impossible. And how many times have we been told that we can't do something? Because it's impossible. You're delusional, Jimmy, to think that. You're delusional, Jeremy, or Garrett, or Bethany, or Brittany, or whoever it might be, right? What I've learned is we as individuals, we base other people's possibilities on our limitations. We base other people's possibilities on our limitations, and so we're always telling everyone else what they can't do based on the things that we believe we can't do. And as human beings, we reject what we don't understand and we base our possibilities on what we know. And so there's the paradox. When they, because if we ever want to do something we've never done before, we got to go above and beyond the place that we know. And we've got to go into that darkness. And so we've got, to, we've got to focus on what we can do instead of what we can't do. 